Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about adding and subtracting radical expressions. So if I was given this expression, negative square root of 27 minus 3 square root of 45 minus the square root of 20 plus 2 square root of 45. Okay? So what I'm doing here is I'm going to see if I can simplify each one of these square roots. Okay? Now, Oh, let's see if we can break this down. So, the square root of 27, well, I know that's 9 times 3, okay? And I know it's 9 times 3, and the reason why I'm choosing 9 times 3 here, uh, specifically, is I know it can take the square root of 9. Now we have uh, minus 3 square root of 4, 45, again, is 9 times 5, and I choose that because I know it can take the square root of 9. Square root of 20 here is just um, 4 times 5, and I choose 4 times 5 because I know I can take the square root of 4. And we've already done square root of 45, this being 9 times 5 here, okay? So now we can separate each one of these to our, its own individual square roots. So we have uh, minus square root of 9 times square root of 3 like this, minus 3 square root of 9 times square root of 5, minus square root of 4 times square root of 5, plus 2 square root of 9 times square root of 5. So now let's simplify which ones we can easily take the square root of. Square root of 9 is a 3, so I have minus 3 square root of 3 here, minus 3 times the uh, square root of 9 being 3, to, uh, square root of 5, minus square root of 4 is 2, square root of 5, plus uh, 2 times square root of 9, which is 3, square root of 5. So now let's simplify a little bit more, the 3 times 3 and the 2 times 3, so we have negative 3 square root of 3, let's just bring that down. 3 times 3 is 9, so we have minus 9 square root of 5 here, minus 2 square root of 5, plus 2 times 3 is 6, square root of 5. So now we want to combine all the ones with the same square roots of 5's here, and then it's these three right here, square root of 5, square root of 5, square root of 5. So the minus 3, square root of 3, is all by itself because it's just sitting there, uh, there's nothing else to combine it with. But now I have the square root of 5, so I look to the numbers out in front of them. A minus 9, uh, minus a 2 is a minus 11, okay, minus 11, but plus a 6 comes out to be a minus 5. So we have a, uh, a minus uh, 5 here. Um, let's double check. Yeah, minus 5. Yeah. So a minus 5 here, uh, square root of 5, when we combine all of them together. And so my final answer here is uh, negative 3, square root of 3, minus 5, square root of 5. So let's recap. We're given negative square root of 27, minus 3, square root of 45, minus square root of 20, plus 2, square root of 45. We simplify each one, okay? Uh, each. Um, square root as much as possible into simplest form, giving me a minus 3 square root of 3, minus 9 square root of 5, minus 2 square root of 5, plus 6 square root of 5. I look at all the ones with the same square roots of 5s, and I can combine those. Minus 9 minus a 2 plus a 6 comes out to be a minus a 5, so that's right there, minus 5 square root of 5, and then minus 3 square root of 3 comes down. Again, giving me my final answer here of minus 3 square root of 3, minus 5 square root of 5.